Hello, my name is Miss Marshall, and I'm with the Fulton County Library System. And I'm gonna give you a quick snippet about the book for our book screen for tweens. And I'm gonna give you a little snippet about a book that I read. I want you all to find interesting too. It's called Al Capone Does My Homework by Jennifer Chodinko. <laughs> So Al Capone, the person Al Capone does my homework, Al Capone was a criminal back in the 1930s. He was actually in Chicago, but he got caught one more time, one last time, and they actually sent him to a, a secluded prison that's in the middle of an island. It's actually in San Francisco, but it's in the middle of the island all by itself, and no one's supposed to be able to get out of this jail. So it's a jail that's secluded. But our character... Moose Lanigan, Moose is one of the characters in there. Him and his family moves there because his dad becomes the warden at the prison. So Moose and his sister Natalie, his mom and dad, they're there. They're going about there every day. So Moose, he has to go to school. So he meets some friends. He got a couple of friends named Jimmy, Teresa, Piper. And um, so they all doing everything. They go to school. They play. They get in trouble. They, you know, they interact with the with the prisoners, they don't supposed to, but they find ways to kind of communicate with them. So one of the famous prisoners, Al Capone, moves, you know, he gets to be friends with him. So what happens in the book that caused a whole lot of trouble for them is a fire breaks out in the Flanagan home. So, but the thing is, Natalie, I didn't meant to, t meant to tell you all that, she's autistic. So they automatically assume that she does it. But Moose say, no, his sister didn't do it. So he's going to prove that she didn't start the fire. So he gets with his friends, get with them to try to figure out who actually started the fire in their home. So, but the key thing to it, he actually got the famous criminal, Al Capone, to help him out. So Al Capone writes him this letter to give him some clues about who started the fire. So, you know, at the end of the book, you know, it all worked out for them. But so at the end... Flanagan and his family, you know, they get the they get to enjoy the rest of their life being on the prison, being in the prison. So, but just to give you a little snippet about it, then, like I said, it was Al Capone does my homework, and you can find it in our library system. And that was just a little quick snippet about it. So, if you have any more, if you want to know more about the book, just check it out because it is an interesting book, and we have other books in the series. It's another book called Al Capone does my shirt. So all this thing, all this series are surrounds Al Capone the criminal. So thank you for tuning in to this to this story and we'll see you next time. Bye.